Okay, in this video, I've got a tip for Windows Vista and Windows 7 users, and it's regarding running software as administrator. Now, if you're using user account control, you may have found that when you've installed certain software, it's asked to be run as administrator. The way that you're usually shown to do this, and I'll use Chrome here as an example, is we go up, we right click, and we'll come down the list so we'll see run as administrator and then left click. This software is now running in under admin privileges and it will run perfectly fine like this now. But if you're using the software a lot, you can forget to do that and you'll start the program up and then oh, admin. So I'm going to show you an easy way of doing that and the way that you won't forget once you've once you've set this up. So all we do, and um, we'll go to Chrome again, is we right click and instead of running as administrator, we'll drop down to properties. So we left click properties. This is going to open up a dialog box for us. And within that box you're going to see a compatibility tab. And that's going to bring up a lot of different options for us. Now the one we're interested in is the one down here under privilege level. Now you'll see that this run this program as an administrator. All we simply do is put a tick in the box, click apply, click OK. Now every time you open this program normally with a, a double click, this program is now running as administrator. And I think you'll find that an easy way for software that you're using a lot and needs admin privileges. Dead easy to do and you're not going to forget to run it. So I hope that helps you out and I'd like to thank you for viewing.